That is uh, a scene from Hoops, a new animated series on Netflix. So we gathered some of the tone from that clip, but tell us about it. Yeah, it's kind of an R-rated comedy. It's a, you know, Bad News Bears meets Curb Your Enthusiasm a little bit. It was created by my friend Ben Hoffman, who's a super funny guy, and Chris Miller and Phil Lord, who did Spider-Verse and Last Man on Earth, are producing it. And we really just wanted to make a kind of loud R-rated comedy for Netflix that, you know, didn't really have a message, wasn't really political, was just for laughs. And so we cast it with as many funny people as we could, from Ron Funches to Natasha Lazario to Rob Riggle. Max Greenfield comes on for a little bit, Damon Wayne's Jr. And, you know, we really just had a blast doing it. Uh, you know, I've got to say that when, when you mentioned the Bad News Bears, a lot of people yeah. associate the Bad <laughs> News Bears with the, you know, the, the new adaptation of the Bad News Bears. But if you watch from the 70s, the ones oh, like, so that good. my parents took us to see, it was the most foul-mouthed, most inappropriate, and it was PG. <laughs> it was it's amazing. Also something about, there's also something about basketball coaches of the era where I was growing up where, like, the Bobby Knights of the world, they were allowed to be terrible people and yes. offensive and loud and go on these rants, and somehow culturally we just allowed it. And so looking back for this show, there's something really funny about a guy like that, especially if he's a terrible coach and he can't win. So we tried to create <laughs> a guy who's as big of a loser as it gets, but he's of that vein of coach where he screams and yells and calls people out, but he tries to do it equally and he kind of hates everybody as much as the next. I'm trying to think. Uh, your, your character does use some salty language. Was there a, a a a real character you modeled this one after, or a hybrid yeah, of loosely, sorts? Loosely, you know, Ben Hoffman obviously wrote this guy and had a pretty good grasp on Coach Ben when I came in. Um, but I grew up, you know, my mother had nine brothers and sisters, and we grew up, you know, they were all Chicagoans, and so I had some foul-mouthed uncles who weren't afraid to tell everybody around them what they thought of them. And as a little kid, there was nothing funnier than watching an uncle scream and yell at somebody. Mm. And so I wanted to tap into that feeling of watching a, you know, a grown up kind of lose it and how funny it is when somebody would go on a monologue of swears of just, you know, <laughs> that guy losing their mind has always been really funny to me. Who do you think will come up to you um, and recognize, you know how you say, like, there's a different group of people yes. that recognize, uh, you will come up to you who, who and yeah, recognize yeah. you for this. Uh, who drunks. are those people? Drunks. drunks. <laughs> this will be, if I'm, if I'm on the streets past 1.30 in the morning, this will be the show those guys go, ha, 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 Coach Ben! <laughs> it, is, it is loud, it's ridiculous, it's a show that's on purpose, kind of in your face, and just, you know, for lack of a better word, it's just a big dumb show, and I think it's really funny like that. Well, listen, I mean, what do you think this is right here? That's that's how we describe this in all of our promos. Big dumb show, only now we call big it dumb a little show. dumb show. Every, every little dumb day. show in the computer. Amazing. Hey, uh, Hoops starts streaming on Netflix August 21st. Enjoy the rest of your day in that closet, and we will see you real soon. Good luck with the show. Thanks, guys. Nice to see you, too. See you, buddy. Bye-bye. see you, Jake.